So, growing up, most will say that um, the woman is unclean, as you, you, you asked earlier. Um, so, I mean, having intercourse during menses is quite nasty and stuff. Mm. I mean, some will say that, um, I mean, it's a taboo, others. But for us as scientists, mm. I mean, trying to be realistic, number one is that I've, I've come across a couple of people who will tell you that they have increased libido during their menses. Mm. There are quite a, some huge number of people who have increased libido during their menstrual, their, their menstrual period. And when you have increased libido, it just means that the chances of having a satisfactory intercourse will be higher during, during your menstrual period. Yeah. So denying these people totally of intercourse during um, menstruation will be quite challenging for them. Mm. Um, for some people, having sex during the, having intercourse during their menses helps them reduce some pain. That's what we call dysmenorrhea. This manure is painful, uh, painful menses. Okay. So, having intercourse help release some some chemicals in the body called endorphins, hmm. which helps to reduce the pain. Okay. And some people, the pain can be so severe that sex becomes like a dietary therapy. Oh. For them. I see. Um, the only challenge with this is that it's, it's quite messy. And then quiet, I mean, um, to say that it's, it messes the whole thing. Doesn't it? Yes, um, it depends <laughs> on you. Mm. But um, also, there are some people who have this headache, severe headaches during their, uh, their menstrual period. Mm. And it's been found that when they have sex during those periods, it helps them. I see. Because that's another myth I was trying to get at. 